trust not achieved falling mayday 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 these were the final chilling words from the cockpit of air india flight 171 seconds before boeing 787 crashed just after take off from ahmedabad the black box is being decoded but some clues including one very critical piece of hardware are already telling us what may have gone wrong four major facts confirm a very catastrophic power loss the rat or ram air turbine which was deployed automatically which only happens during dual engine failure or a very catastrophic electrical loss we have covered this extensively here on aim tv if you haven't seen it please make sure that you check it out next is the cockpit audio which captured a very high pitched whine matching the rat's spinning turbine and finally a survivor who reported a loud bang and lights flickering moments before impact all these signs point to the same conclusion the aircraft lost both engines just seconds into flight but the question is this how can both engines fail modern jet engines are incredibly reliable the boeing 787 can even fly long distances on only one functioning engine not to mention 3 months back the right engine was replaced also the detailed maintenance check was done in june 2023 of the aircraft and the next scheduled maintenance check was supposed to be in december 2025 So well we come back to the fact that both engines to fail at the same time is almost unheard of. So in very hot weather air density drops that can affect how engines breathe. On the day of the crash temperatures in Ahmedabad had touched a 43 degrees centigrade scorching heat which is a little over 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Well could that have caused a compressor stall a disruption of air flow inside the engines maybe but compressor stalls often come with visible flames or audible bangs none were seen or heard and they rarely knock out both the engines at once so while air flow disruption is possible it's not the most likely cause it brings us to the next theory which is fuel problems and there are two theories for this there are two very serious possibilities the first one fuel contamination if water dirt or microbial growth entered the fuel system it could clog lines and starve the engines but fueling at very major airports like ahmedabad is very heavily automated with sensors that shut off supply at the first sign of contamination still if contamination made it past it could explain why both engines failed together the second theory which is called vapor lock now this is where fuel vaporizes inside the lines before reaching the engine pumps especially in extreme heat so jet fuel doesn't need to boil to vaporize heat from the tarmac engine bays and tanks could trigger vapor lock interrupting fuel flow just long enough to cause a dual flame out Captain Steve also noted in his latest video that vapor lock is very rare but in a 43 degree centigrade heat with hot fuel and high thrust demands it is not an impossibility if the cause is isolated to this aircraft it's a very unfortunate tragedy if it is systemic it could impact dreamliner fleets worldwide the flight data recorder will tell us these aspects were the engines producing thrust during climb did fuel flow rates drop was there a temperature spike inside the tanks did both engines flame out at the same time the cockpit voice recorder on the other hand will reveal these facts any warning alarms what the pilots were discussing in those last final tragic moments and if they attempted emergency procedures All this is now being decoded at India's new black box lab in Delhi. Now why does this matter? This is a first fatal crash of a Boeing 787 
and the first major test of India's upgraded aviation investigation system. The outcome may shape future rules on fuel quality, temperature limits and pre-takeoff inspections in extreme weather. It may take months for the final report, but the black box has finally started speaking. We here at Front Page at AIM TV believe in bringing you facts with compassion and no noise. Like, share, subscribe and always remember, think AI, think AIM.